The day is finally here. I'm finally getting a package that I've been waiting for for a little while. I've been holding off on this step of my car for an eternity. I should have done it way before. Now that everything is in place, I have them. They're gonna come soon. So I'll show you guys right when they come. They are in. Oh my God, time to cut up. This is a first box. I'm gonna see how the condition is. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I am pretty sure you guys all expected this. These are Anki RPF ones, as you may all know. Honestly, it's a pretty popular wheel that everyone uses. I'm just gonna take a look. Everything is round. No damage or anything. This is 18 by 10 and a half plus 15. Correct sizes. Doesn't look like there's any damage on this one for the most part. Um, good. I'm gonna put it back in until I get tires. Once again. There's the wheel, it's really light. It is all good from my eyes. Can't wait to see these on the car, man. For the time being, I wanna have it look good in my room. So I'm gonna present it as such. Here we have it, the wheels are here, and they look really good. I'll have them on eventually, but for now, they'll look good in my room. Until then, I'm gonna rest up. Hopefully this sickness passes by pretty quick. I'll see you guys in the future. Future Tyler here. Man, did I mean the future because I'm looking over the footage right now, and that was recorded August 24th, 2018. Now it's December 24th, it's one day before Christmas. You guys are gonna see this on Christmas. This is my little gift to you. I don't know if any of you guys are gonna watch this because you're gonna be with family. I hope you don't watch it, but if you are, thank you. <laughs> That's so crazy what I was talking about. I was talking about how I am done with that bakery job and I was sick. By the way, that sickness lasted forever. And about the bakery job, I'm back at that job, but I really didn't think I was gonna talk about this, but I guess what I'm trying to say is like, if you're stuck at a place you don't wanna be and you think you're not getting any worth out of it, what do you have to lose to fight for what you want? Like bargain with them, hopefully they'll give you what you want. I don't know, I just basically quit. And they wanted me to start working again, but I didn't want to work. So I, they offered more money, da da da. And now I'm pretty happy with where I'm at. Don't settle for less, get what you want. That's kind of what Stay Stubborn actually represents. Staying stubborn towards your vision. I never really explained this, and I'm pretty sure throughout these videos you'll get the gist of it. Speaking of new wheels, this video is about the RPF ones. I'm gonna show you how they're on my car right now. I totally skipped a lot of time, but these videos from now on, um, until I reach the present time, is gonna be me cutting in and out and of the past. I got new wheels for my RC car. These are supposed to be a replica of Model 5s on an RC car. I think they're called Advan AVS Model 5. Search them up and they're like my favorite wheel. Eventually I want them on my car. It's just they're really rare and expensive. The RPF ones will do for the time being, but with my RC car, it's kind of cool that I could experiment and get what I want for like a super cheap price because it's to scale, a 10 scale. I don't have the RC car yet. 
I will though. Stay tuned for those videos. RC cars get me excited as much as real cars do. Maybe that could be my next hobby. Anyways, I've been kind of rambling on. I'm gonna ramble on more outside and show you guys my car. Currently raining. I'm going for a drive somewhere to show you guys the wheels. Oh my God. It's so windy. Here she is. Let's go inside first. <laughs> I really don't want to get my camera I'm gonna go to like a parking garage or something where it's more dry. <laughs> Since we're technically in the past, I don't want to show you guys too much of my car because it'll spoil everything I have. But I think the interior for the most part is the same. Ah! Oh my God, I hate that. It's raining decently hard, it never really rains in California. I'm pretty sure there's only like a couple months out of the year where it rains, not even that much. You gotta take it in. Pretty quick drive. Let's do this. These wheels on the car is definitely different how when I first had them or put them on with uh, different tires. It's been through a good amount of time. Keep that in mind when you're watching this video because this is a completely different setup from stock, especially the fronts. Here we go. So the rears is just like a flush fitment. It's not really too aggressive in my opinion. I definitely need either a thicker tire or a bigger spacer. I really recommend the PBM adjustable spacers just so that when you're playing around with fitment, you don't have to buy multiple spacers. I have a 20 mil right now and a 225, 40 on. Delente. Those are good tires, good and cheap tires to go with. On to the fronts. I'm gonna go in the good lighting. I went with the same tire setup, just a different brand. This tire brand's a seller. I really, I do recommend it. They just run a little bit bigger, which makes Fitment a more pain in the ass because it doesn't have as much stretch. Overall, I really like the RPF fronts on the car. I think it complements the diamond graphite paint color that I have because I don't want to be too flashy right now because I don't have three-piece wheels. So I'll get like a basic ass gray color. Don't mind my rusted hub. I'm gonna paint that, so not, it's definitely unfinished right now. As for the wheel itself, I think Anki did a great job. Way lighter than my stock wheels. I don't know. It's definitely on the lighter side. It's starting right now, so I'm gonna go in the, the shade. If you guys don't know already, they're 18s. I really recommend 18s on a G or a Z. They just, in my opinion, fit the car better. The 19s look a tad bit big for me. Although if you aren't gonna be low, it will look small. And I would go 19s. It all depends on the stance you're going with. I just wanted to be as low as possible. That's why I went with 18s. You could go back in some of my previous videos and look how the 19s look compared to the 18s. These make my car look way smaller, and I don't know, I like it. <laughs> so far with the Anki RPF ones, I haven't had any bending, cracking, or leaks. The wheels are definitely strong and take a beating. Like these wheels are real wheels, and I got mine for 300 each. Definitely a steal when you can't afford the wheels you really want, and you just wanna be on decent looking wheels for the time being. Pretty sure they'll definitely come in handy if you want to have some drift spares or something. Guys, so that's all I'm going to talk about today. If you want to know more about these wheels or other wheels that Anki offers, go check them out. Thank you guys for watching. Merry Christmas and stay tuned for the next video. Also, take a look at this big hunk of exhaust. That'll be changed later. I'm also dancing in the dark